Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Josette and this week I'm going to show you how to get this back to school makeup tutorial. Um, it's all drugstore. I did my very best to make sure I was keeping within the budget of like Walmart, Target, um, that one side of Ulta. Uh, so I really tried hard to create this look for you guys. I think it's really wearable. Um, I honestly think if I hadn't been talking this would have taken me 10 minutes. Uh, not very hard at all. So like, subscribe, ring the little notification bell for me, please, um, and keep watching. So I already went ahead and uh, moisturized my face with the 4th Ray Turmeric Face Milk. Um, in high school, I never primed. Um, I just didn't believe in it. If I did wear makeup, I never wore primer. Uh, but if I were to wear one right now in high school, I'd probably wear the e.l.f glow stick so I'm just gonna put in a little bit here and I'm gonna try to keep it pretty true to what I wore in high school um I even dug out a picture and I used to wear super matte um makeup and it's just not what I wear now I'm a different person let me zoom out no not in I went to Ulta today to buy the foundation that I used to I used to wear the Maybelline Fit me but the dewy one I used to have like every shade of these I was a marching band so I would have a shade for like week one a shade for week two month one shades so I ended up having like seven of them so um first of all I'm just gonna color correct I didn't do that in high school but uh I need it now so I don't know you may need it if you're a senior and like you're studying for all your dual credit classes that may be you and who am I to deny you color correcting? I, I also used to really like the Age Rewind concealer. I really like this. I don't know why I ever stopped using it. I think Shape Tape came out. This was a little scary right now, but I promise it'll match in the end. And yeah, I did used to do this in high school because I contoured in high school. Okay, I don't do that now. I haven't even done it on my channel yet. I don't con I would recommend getting a calendar for those of you that don't and are in school because those super help you stay on track. Like I'm not even kidding you. Color coordinate your classes, get a bunch of dry erase markers, and just keep track of your life. And then for foundation, I did wear a foundation in high school whenever I did wear foundation. But uh, you could either wear like a CC cream or you can go ahead with um, the foundation. But for the sake of this video, I think I'm going to use the foundation. And if not, it may be a little dark for me. The lighting was a little off in the Ulta. I go back to school on Tuesday. My siblings go back on next Monday, so the 26th. Okay, so that was a good match. It wasn't bad at all. Oh, I like this foundation. Why did I ever stop using it? I got a trim today. I always did that before I went back to school. I always got a trim. Okay. So I like the way everything looks. I thought I didn't have any drugstore powder. Then I went back and looked. And I have the Cody Airspun powder. I did use this in high school. I use it to bake um, because who wanted to spend the 40 something dollars on a Laura Mercier baking powder, right? Am I right? Am I right, ladies? Okay, so I would open this in like a little... It's super... <laughs> it's super powdery, like everything is in there. You could use this once and it would last you through like the end of the world really so i'm just gonna use this to lightly powder my t-zone i know now like i can wear super dewy foundation and like if i wanted to just pull out a compact um before class and powder my nose if i wanted to but i know in high school i never did that i never did that um because I didn't want anybody to judge me because not a lot of people wore like I guess we all did we all wore mascara 
but not all of us did like a whole full face so I never felt okay just pulling out a compact and powdering my face yeah not that I need it right now honestly like I said I contoured in high school um, I don't anymore I actually threw away my contouring kit because it expired it was like way past expired actually I had a bunch of makeup that was way expired that's it for that Ooh, for blush I have three options that are like my personal favorite from the drugstore uh, I have the physician's formula toasted cinnamon uh, this looks great on everybody so there's that one I have the elf cream blush there's another one but it's the soft peach one and then um, everyone loves these uh, there's the Milani baked blushes this one is rose de oro and I can't decide which one I actually just would match the best I think it's not as bright a pink as all the other ones so just gonna take this and tap it in here and make sure to tap it off because it is pigmented I take it across my nose and it just add some color to the face I swear it doesn't look like an orange blob so there's that everything's getting mixed up now and so now I have four options for highlight because arguably that's my favorite stuff I have two from Colourpop I have Wisp and I have Lunch Money the only difference between these two I think is that one is more golden undertone and the other one is more of a silver undertone so there's those two and then we have elf glow plus and taupe and then we have it in a golden I feel like I've used these two in tutorials as of late so I'm gonna use with I knew I wasn't using it I don't know why I did all that and this one you just apply it with your finger Okay, so for my brows, I almost forgot those. I did fill in my brows in high school, actually. I used the Anastasia Dip Brow. But today I'm just going to use the e.l.f. Um, eyebrow Pencil, which is just as good as literally anything else I've used. So. I'm not super intricate with my brows. They're already pretty dark as is. That's it. I don't even set them because they're not going to come off. And then for eyes. I hope that wouldn't be bad. For eyes, I have eyelash extensions. But if I didn't, I would wear the Lash Sensational Mascara. But I'm just going to go with this ColourPop California Love Palette. And take the bay. And take the bay and just smudge that into my crease. I don't anything I do really is going to bring attention to my eyes because I've extended gold rush and smudge that onto my lower lash line so if you're watching this comment down below and let me know your major or what you would like to major in if you're not already in college I'm a nursing major, so there's that. I started it off. Keep it going and let me know what you are. And then I'm just gonna take a little bit of the Lash Sensational and put it on my lower lashes. So for lips, I was a big lipstick girl in high school. I had like all of the MAC lipsticks, like I still have them. Uh, I would like love to collect them. It was a serious problem and it still is. So I don't really know what I want to do with my lips today. Because I have a bunch actually. So I have this Morphe lip liner in Foolish. Color Pop liner in, an, in another round. Two of these 
just a tint of balms and then a gloss and another gloss I think I'm just gonna line my lips and use this gloss for this look so this is the lip liner in foolish and just go ahead and Nothing too um, structured. I don't. I don't really know who would care for that in high school. I don't really know who wore lip liner in high school. Maybe I just didn't know anybody. There's some food for thought. Oh, this is so pretty. This is so pretty. I just got it like today. This is the. Catrice Cosmetics um, Volumizing Lip Booster in Nuts About Mary. It's an odd shade name. Okay. I didn't know about setting powders in high school and I wish that I had because oh lord would my makeup break up by the end of the day. This is the L'Oreal and follow but you could also use the Wet n Wild um coconut primer if your skin is more on the dry side but these I I am dry but I do sweat so and so that's the finished look <laughs> it's so setting I really like it it's something I wear now in college um it's not something I would have thought to wear in high school but also whenever I was in high school it was like more like a matte contoured chiseled um the Kylie Kylie Jenner that's what it was I remember walking to Mac with a picture of Kylie Jenner and being like what's on her lips uh, I need it and they gave me Mac lip liner and sore and the lipstick and brave that's exactly what happened um, fond memories I still still wear that lip combo to this day but it, I don't look like Kylie I wish I did okay, uh, so for a first day back to school outfit I'm in college, so my dress code, I don't have one, uh, may not match yours, but I know in certain schools, if you just throw a cardigan over this top, um, it'll be good. Uh, like my school, my high school, if I had just had a cardigan on top of this, I would have been fine. So this is actually a bodysuit. My mom got it for me at TJ Maxx. Um, these jeans are actually part of like the new American Eagle um, curvy line. So they're kind of high-waisted mom jean, and my sandals are literally just from TJ Maxx. It's fine. And then my jewelry, um, my necklace is from Kendra Scott. And then my rose earrings are from a little deep pop store from Judy Lee. I'll link them down below. Are you ready for the first day of school? Aww. He's gonna miss me when I go back to school. Tell him bye. Tell him, hey, Toby, tell him bye. Tell him to just subscribe to my channel. And tell him to like the video. Yeah? Yeah? Bye.